not with our doors are closed, at least we're still able to offer the Sargood experience out in the community. You think about how busy the bike shops have been lately with everyone wanting to go in and, and purchase a cycle um, to be able to go out and ride with their families for the essential exercise. Yeah. For many people with a spinal cord injury, that's just not been possible. Uh, you can't buy an adapted cycle off the shelf. You can't buy an off-road wheelchair off the shelf. You've got to wait a long time and receive you know, considerable financial support to purchase one. So with our equipment uh, and with the use of this trailer, we've been able to take that out to the community and meet people and support them uh, with essential recreation exercise. And, you know, we had the kayaks and they were phenomenal, but we now being able to put them on the roof of a trailer. We can transport them anywhere. And the plan is that we can go out and people could do an activity, we can have a barbecue, and we've got all our um, food and drinks and everything all cold inside the trailer. It's fully decked out with a power supply in there as well, and there's solar on the roof. And so we can charge power wheelchairs when we're out on the road or the power assist hand cycles we can charge. Guests can charge their mobile phones. We've got the hoist that was that we had fabricated up and, and designed and installed on the side as well. Um, so we can easily and safely transfer guests from their day-to-day -day wheelchairs into the various equipment that we're using. It's got everything that we could have dreamed of, really. We're out kayaking with Dave McEachy from Little Manly and we kayaked across to quarant the quarantine station. We were able to pull up on the beach at the quarantine station. We brought a chair with us, so we transferred him out of the kayak and he sat on the beach in a chair and we went up and got a coffee from the cafe down there. And you know that, um, there's no other possible way that Dave would be able to get there. The cafe is inaccessible, you can't actually get down there by vehicle. Um, so us kayaking in, it's, you know, it's an experience that um, is sort of like no other for him. And you know, again, Without the support of the Cauliflower Club, it's just, it's not possible. <laughs> we're constantly, like, grinning from, from ear to ear when we're driving it around. We, we're like, pinch ourselves because we can't believe that it ended up happening, so we're forever grateful to you guys. <laughs>